Good morning, friends. We're going to start another What We Ate. It's Sunday morning. It's 6.45. It's very, very dark. <laughs> I got up at um, 5. Yes, the boys were up at 5. Mary is headed out hunting. And I guess they wanted to say goodbye to him before he went hunting. A friend needed someone to come along moose hunting with him. And Marius is always down for moose hunting. No. So we have a times four batch of my soft sourdough master recipe. Um, we try to take Sunday as a day of rest. I actually really enjoy baking bread on Sunday because we don't have a lot of other things going on and I can just really enjoy the bread baking process. We have, just a second for you, coffee with whipped cream because we have filled our whipped cream dispenser, which I didn't realize these weren't like, people didn't realize what these are. We put raw cream and we put maple syrup in here and there's like a little charger cartridge, I don't know, I forget what, NO2, CO2, which one it is, I don't know, but it, there's a little thing in there. And then you have whipped cream on tap. Oh yes, so the girls got milk with a splash of coffee and they're very happy about that. Uh, even though the kitchen was clean before bed, it's already chaos this morning. I made an apple pie, and when I make an apple pie later in the day, we usually don't have it for dessert, but we have it the next morning for breakfast. So that's why we were having whipped cream. We had apple pie and whipped cream. I haven't had breakfast yet. We're watching Swamp People, enjoying some weekend morning TV, which... Hi. Hi. And then like doing stuff today. Oh, and we got a puppy. Mm -hmm. Where's our puppy? Hey, Sky Blue. And we have goats. Sky Blue. Come here, Sky Blue. Um, and we have goats. Sky Blue. Oh, yes. Thunderstar doesn't like Sky Blue. This is Sky Blue. She's oh, a Border Collie cross. We're not really sure oh. what she's all crossed with. We think there's something like Newfoundland or Marema in there. They said she's a nerf Newfin she said they said she's a border collie Australian shepherd. But we're pretty sure there's something else in there. Anyhow, she's three months old. We've had her for a week now. And she's proving to be a very good puppy. Oh, and we got something else. What did we get for goats. We got goats. We'll show you those later. I guess that's a what we ate because they're milk goats. Although they're not Ooh, ruin. That was quite the cough. They're not in milk yet, they're due in January. Okay, the dog is licking me because I wiped my hands on my pants when I was baking bread and she's cleaning it up. Hi, Mom. Her horns are nice, twisted, and no, and no. Freya wanted to show you our new goats. Their names are Hazel and Lily, and they are salmon goats. This is an old lambing shed that was here when we bought the place. And we have them closed in here for now. I like to close in animals in a smaller pen when we first get them whenever possible because they're often spooked at being in a new place. So it kind of gives them a smaller space to get accustomed to us. Uh, Mac already fed the pigs. I already fed them too. You could bring them some more hay if you wanted. Anyhow, gives them a smaller space to get accustomed to. It's nice and warm and cozy in here. And nice and bright because we can leave one door open. This is Hazel. And that's Lily. Hazel. Good morning. Everybody's had tea and coffee. I'm scrambling some eggs, ooh, that's bad lighting, and toasting the cinnamon swirl sourdough bread in some ghee, which is just clarified butter, and the reason I'm doing it in ghee, and these scrambled eggs as well, is because, well, it's awesome to cook in, but I made it, and then I store it in the root cellar or the canning shelves, and, um, if we don't have any soft butter, ghee is still a spreadable consistency, so it's been great to use for that. 
Um, and yesterday I also made brownies in the evening too because why not? So we don't tend to eat dessert after dinner, especially when we eat a later, later dinner. So we're gonna enjoy these today. Winter has arrived this morning. It is minus 12 Celsius, which is 10 degrees Fahrenheit. And I actually didn't even realize it was that cold. I took the pup out at 4.30 in the morning and I should have clued in because the snow crunched. But it wasn't until I got inside and checked the thermometer, I was like, oh wow, it's cold out. I've got a pot of broth about to start simmering. I have a gallon of broth in the fridge too, so I'll probably end up canning some broth. And yeah. let's see, what else do we have going on? Over here, we're doing some sprouts. The kids are super into these. Um, this is only day two, so they don't look like anything yet, but the kids really love these. I'll try to show them as they grow. So for lunch, the boys are gonna have some friends here and I'm gonna send them outside to make a fire and roast hot dogs. And for dinner, I made hamburger, burger, hamburger buns yesterday when I made bread because I have hamburgers that I made from venison and froze for a day like today. So, plus the brownies, plus carrot sticks, plus probably sauerkraut with our hamburgers. Maybe I'll make french fries with dinner too. That's kind of what my plan is for today. Rowan's having some tea and milk. I hate sippy cups, so she drinks these sort of things out of bottles because, oh, you be gentle with that or it gets put away. No. Oh, you're upset because Freya took your Christmas tree? Hey, Freya. Rowan would like the Christmas tree back. We have three of these. My mom and stepdad made these years ago. They're a Christmas decoration, and Rowan just found it in the basement. And I got a robot. I decided to make some oven fries with lunch, so I put some tallow on top of the potatoes, then I'll pop it in the oven, and once it's melted, I'll toss them around and roast till crispy making a big batch of buns, which will be so delicious, and we're gonna share with our friends. For lunch, because it's not gonna be ready, and Marius needs to head out, he just fried a couple eggs, cheese, sourdough toast, so good. I ended up wrapping the hot dogs in some of the bun dough and baking them, and the kids thought I was about the best mom ever. I've got my coffee this morning. Last night we did have hamburgers for dinner. We had hamburgers with sliced apples, carrot sticks, it's good. For breakfast this morning, we have sourdough buns with bacon, fried eggs, and homemade Colby cheese. So, fried egg sandwiches. Um, this is the cheese. Delicious. Yeah, they're delicious. Are biscuits yummy, Rowan? Are biscuits so, so yummy, yummy? Yeah, if you wash your hands, I've never done it before. Nah. 
Mm -hmm. Kind of stirring. The soup I made, the broth is so gelatinous that my soup is solid. But it'll be good once it warmed up. It'll be amazing. Jessa gives so much cream that even though she only gives us just over a gallon of milk a day, I still have to make butter. The milk is so creamy, we would probably get a stomach ache if we just drank it as whole milk. So this is an awesome blessing, although I kind of expected to have a break from making butter and such. And you can see the pots of yogurt, which is what I used the skim milk for. Today is Friday, so you successfully now seen Sunday to Friday snippets of our food. I canned a bunch of stew meat yesterday to free up freezer space. Hamish is filling up the Berkey and have a good weekend friends.